How is it going, everyone? How are we doing today? It's a fine, it's a fine, fine Thursday, ladies and gentlemen. I hope everyone's doing great. Hope everyone's having a great, grand old day so far. I'm having a good day. Let me pull up my stream. One second, chat, one second. <clears throat> How's it going, Ryan Dunlop? Enchanted Nightmare, how are you guys doing today? What's up, Smiley? What's up, Sir Sheep? What's up, Ramanu? What's up, Helicopter? Jadster? Friendly Idiot, how are you guys doing? Let me pull up my Twitch chat. Alright. Everything looks like it's good so far. What's up, AM? How you doing, bro? What's up, Super Turbo? How you doing, brother? My man, Super Turbo. Okay. Let me know how everyone's Thursday's going. What you guys have been up to? Did you guys just go to school? What's been going on for everyone? Into chat today's chat. Has the ten dollar request loaded always been there? It has, but I'm just putting it on the screen this time. Uh Calvin Venkatesh always requests don't always request loadouts. He's like the main loadout requester. I've actually been sick, skipped school today legally. Bro pulled an Ninjaius. Pulled an Ninjaius, skip school to play balloons. All right, one second. Hmm, okay. Let's look for a match. Let's look for a match, guys. We got Goat Factory. We're gonna go Ben Hamin here with Bolt Alchemist and Spike Factory. We honestly can't make fun of Ninjaius for that anymore. He exposed his grades and he's a straight A student. Oh, dang it, bro. Ryan, we're stopped looking this fine. I gotta hide my girlfriend, dude. I'm sorry, bro. That's just that's just the way it is sometimes, bro. That's just the way it is. I know, I know, Ryan, you look so good. Ryan this, Ryan that, that's what everyone tells me, but I can't help it, you know? I can't help it. We're gonna give me the good luck there. All right, we're gonna go Bulldog Spike Factor with Churchill. Why not? Hello, what's up, Katana? How tall is the biggest balloon popper? I am six foot four. How would you nerf Boomerang? Because as it is unrushable, uh, I mean, Boomerang's just a good mid-game tower. It's pretty bad late game, though, but they probably should nerf the, um, the turbocharge a little bit. Okay, I messed up my eco numbers. It's fine, though. 6-4, I'm gonna need proof on that. Bro, I'm 6 foot 4, bro. I don't know what type of proof you need. Alright, got our Churchill down. I think everyone should just quickly like up the stream, I agree. I think everyone should quickly like up the stream as well. Dart and Science Gwendolyn. And they placed- oh wait, I need to change my camera. They placed their Science Gwendolyn at the back of the map, which is interesting here. Because it's not gonna really like- I guess they'll probably be using it for the cocktail, is gonna be the main purpose, right? Because They'll have the cocktail in the back, and they'll probably have like a submarine to pop the purple balloon layers, which is a decent combination, but the Gwendolyn's fire that it applies on the balloons will be pretty much useless. A height certificate? Hey. Of course, bro. Oh, also, I was reading the chat. I got my boat down late. That was crap. So we leaked some. We're fine, though. A 
How do I get a height certificate? How tall is your foot? So my other foot's foot is... I don't know how tall it is, actually. How tall is your foot? Dart Ice Farm? No, it's not Dart Ice Farm. It's gonna be Dart Sub Farm, for sure. For my opponent. It's definitely Dart Sub Farm. Never checked, hold on, let me get my ruler. Ryan, what is this title? You're like five, I'm not five nine, what? What are these allegations? Why is the punk going science, Gwendolyn? Probably for the cocktail. If they have a reactor on their side, the reactor will pop all the purple balloons and then their science win cocktail is super strong. Is my assumption of why they brought science win. Okay, 5'9 and 1 16th. Bro is... Bro is the copper, bro. Bro is the copper. Could also be Spike Factory, right? Yeah, it could be Spike Factory, but I, th I think it's Sub. I think Submarine's the most likely candidate for their third. They are getting All right. Okay, they use Cocktail. I'm gonna get up a um, Spike Factory on my side. Use Churchill ability as well. Okay, they, their Cocktail died out, so we're gonna send them more. Yep, there's the submarine. Force tower boost as well with it. All right, send some more. They don't have a okay, forced air burst. I'll take that. I'll take it, and we're gonna get long life spike runes on our side. Are bad, you're assuming you're 5'9, is now clear your maximum 5'1. I'm not 5'1. What? What are these what are these heights that you guys have given me? 5'1? I'm not 5'1, bro. This back needs massive nerfs. True. How much do you have to donate to play against you? Uh, it's ten dollars for a one v one as well. Same thing for a request load or one v one. I'm three ten, four hundred pounds, lean muscle. True. He's shown me. He's not lying. All right, stand up and show the mammoth that they're dealing with. Okay. I will after this game. I'll try to prove my height to you. But like, even if I stand up next to my door or like touch my ceiling or something, you guys are gonna just say, "Oh, Ryan's standing in a room with a seven foot, a seven foot tall ceiling." Like that's just what's gonna happen. Also, I forgot to get my lead to gold up, which wasn't very good. What a rush, ladies and gentlemen. What a rush. That was a that was a very good rush for my opponent. Okay, we forced boost and cocktail. And they actually still died. Nice work, soldier. Grab like a yardstick? Who doesn't have a yardstick in their house? I don't have a yardstick, bro. Okay.
Low ceiling. Guys, my ceiling would have to be, like, if I'm 5'9", my ceiling would have to be, like, 6 feet tall. Jump and hit your head on the ceiling. True. At your service. At your service. Six four valid, I think. Dude, I know. I to told you guys I'm six four. Bro got that two block tall Minecraft house. <laughs> two block tall Minecraft house. True. When's the next subathon? I don't have a ruler, bro, with me. Next subathon will be in the summer. Probably the start of the summer. Decently less than them. Balloon boost? I wouldn't. I wasn't gonna balloon boost because they are boosting anyways. Balloon boost doesn't do anything against a tower boost. What would you recommend when I want to play Battles Two but I have PTSD from it? Uh, lose your PTSD. My recommendation. I have a math test tomorrow. Good luck on your math test. Good luck, good sir. Yo, Ryan, how are you? I'm doing pretty good. How are you doing? Well, I'm sick, so I've got it. No test tomorrow. Gotcha. True. I forgot about your sickness. Oh, wait. I, I didn't even get my farm down. That was kind of bad. I missed out on a banana, ladies and gentlemen. And I'm probably going to miss out on another banana. We sold their farm. Maybe keep this on first. I think strong targeting is causing me to leak a little bit more than I should. Uh, maybe not. My bomb's kind of just throwing. No way. Keep on strong. Do you stream for fun or profit? For fun, for the most part. I mean, obviously the money I make is good from, nice from it. But I enjoy streaming. You guess how long you're on centimeters then? I don't look up the conversion. Um, cin how long I am in centimeters would be like six, four, would be like 190 centimeters. I think my math is correct. 190, right? They're going mortar. It's not even sub. Bomb mortar farm. It's interesting. It's on strong, right? Yeah. Do you boost round two or round three with bomb? Uh, 
On this map, I boost at like this end of round two, start of round three. Keep boy. So definitely want to take this late because there's not really a way they're popping a fortified BAD on this map with Bomb Mortar Farm and Highwayman Jericho. Okay, if they're not sending me ceramics, I'm just gonna go for another farm. If they do send me some sort of rush, I'll probably boost against it. Oh, my thing's actually... Maybe I should just build up the reactor, to be honest. Because... Let's direct the bad. Have we tried ace back farm on dino? I... In a long time ago, I'd have tried it, but it hasn't been any time recent. Yeah, we're good against that. They tried rushing through reactor and bomb. That was kind of surprising. That was a big rush they sent. Can you do the streams early, also next week? Uh, I think this is the best time for me to stream for the most part during the week. During the weekend, I can stream earlier because people don't have work or school. But during the week, this is the best time to, I think, have the most viewership for me. Okay. Interesting rush. They're dead. I will. Hey, if you lose. They're dead, they're dead. I'm sick today, so home from work. Nice. Well, not nice that you're sick, but nice that you're home from work. Alright. Let's play another. Let's play another one. One second, chat. All right, we're good. Super Tiger. Is this the person I just played against? I think it might be. How far are you from... Oh, I don't know. I lost some ELO yesterday, LMS, so I'm pretty far, I think. Dino Graveyard? Hmm. Dino Graveyard. What do I want to play here? Um. Is there anything interesting I can play? I'm trying to think of a fun loadout. Well, that. We have a Darling Engineer Farm. How do I defend against Red Balloons? Uh, Gwendolyn. And then I'll get my Darling later. When the Red Balloons push. Yes, the other one, Druid. You should have played Ace Back Farm, true, but I picked Gwendolyn off the start. And with Ace Back Farm, you don't want to go Gwendolyn with it. I would have had to pick Biker Bones off the start. Yes. 
They just all copy me, LMS. It's fun for me. I was the one who started the Dartling Wind movement on Dino. He is dead to purples right now? True. I did not actually realize that my opponent's dead to purples right now. That's a good suggestion for Rush. Get drained hard by FBFBs and lose attack farm order. To get drained hard to FBFBs when I have misdirection. What? I mean, obviously can, they can misdirect it back, but it makes it so much easier to deal with them. I just don't really get drained that hard. Attack farm order still might win, but they don't win with FBFBs. They win with late game. We're just gonna keep greeting with our farms. It's gonna be our plan. Be really greedy with our farms. I'm fine leaking some early game. It's not that big of a problem. Second farm down. Let's target the cocktail right there. Let's throw in a cocktail. And then we're going to second Dartling down here pretty soon. Perfect. I got my second Dartling a little bit late, so I might be in trouble because it doesn't have the Gwyn buff currently. These white balloons will certainly push on my side. I might have some issues defensively. We'll see what I can do. Hopefully I get my Cocktail back pretty soon. We're good. We're good. We're good. What's better, offense or defense? It depends on the strategy and your opponent's strategy and the map. A lot of factors. Oh, it should be on back on last now. Depends on a lot of factors there. They're being really aggressive at me with these balloon sins, but we defend them all pretty well. <clears throat> I I think even Ben sitting down is taller than you. That's just not true, bro. Ben sitting down is not taller than me. That is just not a fact. Trend of everyone doing tier lists right now and make one of your own? I might. I did see that everyone was doing tier lists the other day. Wonder how Blurp was doing? Is his elo fixed? I don't know. I haven't seen much about Blurple recently. I don't know how my man Blurple was doing. I'm unaware. Let's get my bank up. Let's actually send them a little something. Okay, we baited that out of them. That's good. If they send me a rush, I'll probably boost against it and be fine. I don't think I need a Hydro Aquapods if I boost against a rush. Yeah, we don't.
And then a re-rush, I can get up a Hydrocopods. Are they re-rushing me? Oh, that's a pretty small rush. I'm good. I think. Yeah, we're good. Two, zero to two is greater than HRP. It's a small rush. It wasn't layered at all. It wasn't balloon boosted. It's Dino Graveyard, one of the longest maps in on one of the longest maps in the game. It was three smile? No, it wasn't three. It was two zero two twos and one zero two zero. Hydrocopods is stronger than it, but it I built up into that a lot easier. We'll boost this. these rushes. I'm gonna stop my eco at 12.50. Stop my eco right there. Oh, I should probably go for a balloon trap. I completely forgot I have engineer in my loadout. I completely forgot about that. Sorry, Ryan, what are you sorry about? Fortified ZMG. Okay. Big trap this when it comes around. They got their druid leaks, so nicely done. I sold the wrong engineer. I should have sold my other one because this one doesn't collect near as much. Do I get it before the round ends or no? Make sure that I'm collecting AI balloons. With this. Dead to GTs, right? Handle it. 
Okay, they're just gonna first strike every DT, they're 100% dead. Zero two four more efficient. For the, what, marketplace? Or central market? R what are you talking about? For the balloon trap? Zero two three is technically more efficient, zero two four isn't. But you still don't wanna go for zero two three because it builds up, the build up into it's a lot worse. Uh, not necessarily, boy, because your build up into that marketplace is awful. Because you don't have the top path. The only time I go for a 0 2 3 over a 2 0 3 marketplace is if I sell like defense and then I have like 5k on hand, so the build up doesn't matter, then I'll build up a 0 2 3 marketplace. If that makes sense. Um, what do I go here? I will just go this. You lose so much on selling fact bank for your engine tubes and traps around 23. Point where it's not worth. And it probably wasn't worth there. Because I had to sell the monkey Wall Street right after. But I'm pretty sure I also could have gone round 22 Monkey Wall Street Ninjas. I was planning on getting round 22 and selling my Hydro Rocket Pods with it. I just didn't do it in the moment. That was my whole plan. Round 22 would have been worth. What's up, Ryan? How's your day going? Pretty good. How's your day going? Yeah, 0 0.15 rounds faster is not really that important if your build-up is awful into it. Because you don't get the greater production farm beforehand. That's why you only go for a 0 0.23 marketplace. You only go for a 0 0.23 marketplace if, um... What is it? If you have the money, like 5k on hand, out of nowhere, from selling something. Love the videos, Ryan. Keep the good work. Yo, thank you so much, bro. Appreciate that a lot. I did not place that farm in time. That's annoying. You think? Do you think that going from lead to BFB is good in only three hours? That's not bad. Do I keep this on strong. I don't even play tack anymore. I haven't played this strategy in so long. Probably just micro the targeting. Love the video, trying to keep a good work. Thank you. Will you gangsta with us until they add Bows TV, Ryan? Dude, I want them to add Bows TV so hard. That's like the, my one of the main requests I have for the game. Battles TV would be so nice. Especially for tournaments. If they had Battles TV, that'd be very, very nice.
my opinion, 2v2 would save the game. 2v2 mode would be pretty cool as well. I'm just gonna spam 2 0 farms early game. See how many I can get. If they send me like region zebras next round though, I will need a uh, balloon buster on my mortar. Alright, they have a mortar as well. It's fine. people wager on games, what, wager monkey money? That'd be cool. This is on strong, yeah, that's the correct targeting. Jericho should steal 500. How to play against farm anti-stall with an eco strategy? And it's not really a simple question to answer. There's tactics you can do to um, st help stall the rounds when they're trying to anti-stall. But it can be pretty difficult depending on the loadouts. That's why farm is a really good tower right now. Please answer my question, Ryan. What's your question? Ryan, I have Gwyn, Quincy, and Oban. What should I get next? Good for most strategies. Get Jericho next. Jericho next. Yo, Kevin Venkatesh with the eight-month member message. He says, wow. How's it going, Kevin? Welcome to the stream. They'll be using the chat from man Kevin. Oh, I should steal. I don't know how long that steal available. I wasn't really paying attention. I still don't even have a shell shock on my side. We'll get it in a second. Wiz abuse strat. You want me to go a wizard strat and use the glitch? I got you. Thank you for the donation, Kevin. W's in the chat. Best version of Jericho? Um, Star Captain and Highwayman are debated to be the best. Most of the time I see people using Highwayman though. So I'd probably stay Highwayman. Is DB stands for Desmond Bryant? Not Dustin Bryant. Uh, Desmond Bryant is the name, but yeah. That is what it stands for. They didn't fix the glitch? No, they haven't fixed the wizard glitch yet. But honestly, it's not as bad. It's not as overpowered as I thought it was initially. It's not like super duper game breaking. Is that a super chat I smell? Thank you. Wiz Abuse Strat. Boxyops is 50% of all wizard players, true. Through that. Crap, I went for the top path. Shouldn't have done that in that case. Well, no YouTube, no delayed YouTube streams? 
I think there's a small delay, but it, it's I have it at the minimum. Whatever the options are. It's at the minimum. We're good. Sending me a BFB. It's fine. Let's get two K. Let's get three K eco. Oh wait, why did I go for an artillery battery? I have misdirection. I completely forgot about that. I mean, I guess we can anti-stall, and they sent me another one anyways. So, yeah, it's not the end of the world. I got an artillery battery there. I now own two of your top five YouTube shorts. That's what I'm talking about with Mir. Are you proud of yourself? Are you proud of yourself with Mir? A little bit, yeah. I'd be proud of myself too. Is this the end of the round? I think ABOT used to be like 2k cheaper. Yeah, ABOT used to be a lot cheaper, but it's still a pretty solid upgrade. For 3k eco around 24 monkey wall street is crazy. It's not very hard to get when you're against an eco loadout and they don't even have Jericho. Jer Facing Jericho versus non Jericho makes a huge difference. Makes a ginormous difference. But also, this guy wasn't super aggressive as well. They only sent a couple of rushes. Well, I think the only rush really was actually like the BFBs. Um, how would I nerf Boomerang right now? Probably a small nerf to Turbocharge. And then maybe a nerf to um, more presses knockback to ZMGs. Probably a small nerf to that as well. What do I do against BADs? Just spam a million overdrives on the map? I'm pretty sure. By the way, Parma Spike has no lead popping. Just saying. Yeah, that's definitely a problem for them. That's crazy. That's crazy, dude.
I had that many overdrives and somehow like two ceramics got through. Misdirection does not exist. I thought my 30 overdrives would just defend the BFB to be honest. Would defend the BFB and the ceramics. I was gonna I was gonna save the misdirection for a B a fortified ZMG from the um from the BAD. That's what I was saving my misdirection for. I just needed artillery battery, I guess. How much ELO did you lose? I don't know. I don't really care. About the ELO. You had ABAT? I didn't really want to use ABAT ability either, to be honest, because I wanted to upgrade the ABAT into a um, pop and all when the BAD pops to stun it. The whole problem was I just didn't target my ABAT. But yeah. I didn't want to use the ABAT ability or misdirection against AI. I just thought we would defend it straight up. Wiz Abuse? I'm not going to be able to use Wiz Abuse on Garden. That wouldn't happen. Not going to happen. You'll see, uh, J Papers. Let's move out. And to be honest, I didn't even see the BFP, like, I wasn't paying any attention to the BFP on my side. I was just paying attention to building up overdrives and selling my farms. No, I'll, I'll go the Wiz Abuse strategy. I just don't go, I don't... I wait till it's a good game to do it. It's not going to be fun for Kav and Venkatesh's donation if I go the Wiz Abuse strategy on guard and then die round 11. <laughs> like, what's the point of that? I'm not going to go it if it's a bad map for it. It's... I did not get that round one. I anti stole too hard. It's alright. You wish Tech Ice Village would be met, it's a fun strat. Yeah, Takas Village is pretty fun. Takalu Village is a better strategy right now, though, for sure. You have a much better greed with it and cheaper leaking defense. Did you figure out the ace targeting? I have not. You show us your ace micro, my ace micro is pretty garbage. So we got our Jericho late, so we're not gonna get our steel till um when is it? Till round six, which is unfortunate. So probably have to boost here. If they send me whites. Send me greens, I don't need to boost. We don't need to boost then. Well, actually, if they layer whites over greens, I might need to. Now oh, we're good. Oban, Tack Ice Farm on Koru? Alright, I got you, Kavin. So. You want me to go Oban, Takai's Farm, and Koru, and you want me to go Wizard Bug. I'll do both of them for you at some point. Thank you for the donations. I appreciate it a lot, Kevin. No, 
No, pop those blue balloons. Try to anti stall. Good. You use Embrit for camos, is the way you normally do it. It used to be, a, it was a popular loadout back in the day. Is that a super chat I smell? Thank you. Albin Tack Ice Farm on corner. I mean, that's easier with Mirror for sure, but I don't really want to take it late. And you get a lot better anti stolen pressure with this. Yeah, they're going glue. T Dark Blue Village? The heck is this? What is this nonsense? They're dead to AI. Okay. Four one zero doesn't get all the camel purples. If they balloon boost camel purples, you boost against it. But you also have Oban Brambles in the back of the map to clean up Trunker. And you have Oban Totem, which slows down the balloons inside of the range of the um Embrit. Wiggity wiggity what up gang? Wiggity whack. What up? Chap. What's the design of your t-shirt? Give me a second. Let's see if he skips this map. They do. Power Cove, I'll skip. We got star. Okay. The design of my t-shirt. It's like um mountains and a bear let's go this with helicopter did you think of merch yeah i used to have merch but I didn't really like the designs too much. I need to... I need to um think of good designs with merch. Oh, it's definitely a sweaty pits. For sure. Yeah, start with the fireball right here. Bro, like me for real with the sweat, dude. Just like my boy. Got a Zeely down. Was this a requested strat? They requested me for me to go the um, Wizard Lord Phoenix bug. So I just decided on my strategy with it. This was the strategy I came up with. Merch would be so fire. It would. I could have a shirt that said like calculated on it and then it said had like one heart on the shirt because that's something I say all the time when I like leak down like one life from a Russian almost die I'm like calculated or like not even close I could say that as well. Yeah. They should call you Micro Mahalik that's what they call me. Call me Micro Mahalik. Not even close would be better. You should make a shirt that says a defend is a defend. The thing is, a defend is a defend. That's kind of like Bulltrix's catchphrase though. Like I've said it a couple times, but that's like, I don't know. That's like Bulltrix's line. Yeah, they got their Druid of Wrath up. Oh, you know? Oh, okay, you just want me to steal his line. I see. 
That's funny. They call me the Juan Degler. They do call you that. You get all those one deeks when we play CS. Bro has the two, the two unupgraded farm tech. Okay. See you. A merch with just Winston in his grab. Just, just a picture of Winston on merch. Would go crazy. <clears throat> so what's the plan for purples? I can probably just get a heli up. I can, well, I can use a ZD level three ability to let my wizard hit purples, and then I can just get a heli up. What's the plan for those. All right, some yells. They're gonna need a lightning against this, or they're gonna need a tower boost. It handles yells a decent length, but it will get overrun. Cause I can send a lot since I only have a wolf fire on my side, and this is pretty cheap. Yeah, they get lightning up. Okay, if they use send me purples, I'm just gonna use the Z level three ability. So far, nothing. Isn't this like the third game against Super Tiger? It is. This guy has been enjoying playing against me for sure. Let me get my heli down. Yeah, we're good. One zero three Druid defense infinite yells on Oasis. Um, it, no, it still actually gets overrun on Oasis. It just takes an extremely long time to get overrun. I also have my heli in a terrible spot. Alright, well, this is not good. We're fine. We're good. We're good. Not even close. I shouldn't have brought my heli downwards. I brought my heli downwards, and then I kind of put myself in a bad position with that. Oh, I'm dead. Never mind. Yeah, I misplayed that starting on round nine. Once I brought my heli downwards, everything just went back downhill. If I just kept my heli at the top, and then got a necromancer with my heli, I would have been in such a good position. Wizard sucks, nah. Wizard doesn't suck, I just suck. That was on me, that wasn't on Wizard. Bringing my heli downwards just put me in a terrible position. That was not Wizard's fault, that was my fault. You should have boosted immediately. I mean, the problem with boosting there is I think I'm dead round 13 if I boost. So I wanted to try to defending it without boost. Lucky anime. I could, I guess I could maybe have upgraded totem, but I still probably would have died round 13 if I boosted there. Oh, we got star. What is this? What is this? He skips. Building site. Well, we did not get Koru, so I can't go Takai's farm. Why go Heli over farm with Bomb Mortar Striker? Um, Heli, Heli, um, Bomb Mortar. Most of the time gets more money than farm Bomb Mortar. Because you have really cheap mob defense with mob shove, and you can stall the rounds extremely well with heli. So you tend to be able to afford your late game defense easier with heli than farm if you're going bomb mortar. In my from my experience, you get more money with heli with that loadout. If you get ports, you also have to go tack farm ice open. I have to go tack farm ice open on ports. What is this? What is this, bro?
Hey, sorry, I saw your profile and just thought you looked cute in your picture. I really wanted to tell you that. It's really rare to see girls playing video games, haha. I don't know why it's a guy thing, honestly. I'm just really against misogyny, and I'll be in the one kit in the kitchen making sandwiches. We should play Left 4 Dead 2 sometime. It's a really cool zombie game and a lot of scary moments. Don't but don't worry, I'll be there to protect you. Sorry, I wasn't flirting, I swear. What what is that message, chat? Someone's trying to flirt with me. Ryan got paid to say that? No way. It was a message in my Twitch chat. You're going farm on this map? With tack? Tack whiz farm or tack mortar farm? Probably tack mortar farm. Yeah, it's definitely tack mortar farm. They're um they're kind of struggling the white balloons. See the problem with Tack Mortar Farm is that Tack does not really defend that well oh gosh, on this. Thank you for the Twitch sub. I Yo, thank you so much for the Twitch sub, Chubby Cow. I appreciate that a lot. Tack, uh, the problem with Tack Mortar Farm on this map is that Tack does not defend that well without Bolt kind of supplementing some defense, and um you don't have you don't have the initial camo detection from your merchantman. So that causes issues for you. Okay, I think they're dead. Yeah. Thank you for the uh, Prime subscription, Chavico. I really appreciate that. That's a W moment indeed. Should consider custom animation for subs. Custom animation. For like Twitch subs? And like YouTube members? That's what you're saying? Average B-Site match? Indeed. Adam said oops at the start of the game anyways. Oh, did he not mean to bring farm? Probably decently likely. How would you buff Pat Fusty? He shouldn't cost $900 to begin with, so I'd probably lower his price to $800-750. And then, on top of that, maybe buff his Pierce a little bit early game. And then that, that's what I'd do. Ryan, you're such a lovable guy. Yo, thank you, Brandon. How you poppin'? I'm poppin' the balloons. How you poppin', bro? How's it going, guy Sar? How you doing today, brother? Zooper duper. Okay, can we get can we get um Koru? I'm not going talk for my open on ports. I don't care if you said it. We got bot factory, bro. What is this? What is this map, bro? Bot factory? Heli Mortar Glue Gunner. Bro, scam. Hey, we didn't end up getting ports, Cap. And anyways, we didn't even end up getting ports, so I didn't scam you out of anything. Ryan, love your content. Thank you, bro. I appreciate that, John Adir. Mortar Heli Alk. No, I, I think glue's better than Alk with this loadout. I like glue better. Both definitely are good though. Also, I sent too many reds. Okay, mortar, please hit the balloons. All right. I love BFAC it has such diverse gameplay. It does, dude. It's the, it's the epitome of diverse gameplay. This map. Do you agree that Quincy, Gwyn, Jericho, Oban are the best heroes? Oh, is the best strat? Yeah, Quincy, Gwyn. Jericho and, o and Owen is the best strat indeed. 
is the best strat. You can run so many different strategies on this map. True. True, true, true. I love running running Owen with my Quincy. Owen is the Owen's the new um the new meta hero. It's the new meta hero, guys. Mortar's awful on this map, true. Does Mortar not have two damage in battles too? No, it doesn't. I'm gonna let them steal before me so I can avoid it. We'll, we'll avoid their, we will avoid their steal and then I'll steal after. Well, we avoided some of it. We didn't avoid the whole steal, but we avoided a decent bit of it. And I use my steal slightly after. And I should be able to get a pretty. Did I get a max steal on them? I did. Okay. So they got like a 150 steal, or maybe even less than 150, and I got a max steal, which is pretty good. So that's that's a W play, ladies and gentlemen. W play. It's boat. Okay. If they're going boat, I want to stall the round, so I'm gonna get a glue gunner down. They're probably going mortar boat ace. Yeah, you're right, Smiley. I could have done that. You right. Normal Jerry better than Hyoman here, yeah. The reason why people go normal Jerry in this map is because um Heli strategies are the best strategies on this map. And normal Jericho is the strongest Jericho against Helis. Late game. And this is a late game map too. Because um the decoy mob does pretty good stuff for you late game. Good. I'm surprised they did not go for a merchantman. They're just going full eco. Avoid some of their steel here. Okay, we avoided a lot of that steel. That was good. Wait, I got the wrong, um... Dang, I got the wrong path on this. I'll just play it safe this game anyways, though. I'll just go for an artillery battery if they rush me, because going, going the middle path on this more is actually not that bad here, because they have boat, so they're gonna be, um rushing me much anyways, so we're actually just going to heavy shells here, and then I'll build this into an artillery battery for rushes. Be the plan. I'm going to play it a little bit differently since I'm against boat here and not heli glue. Love the scarfy beard. Yeah, I appreciate that. Are they rushing me? Nope. Got yeah, more targets back. Steel. They're balloon boosting nothing at me. Interesting balloon boost. But yeah, the whole plan against rushes is I can boost against a rush and then I'll get my artillery battery against a rerush. But the moment doesn't seem like they're gonna even rush me. Yeah, they haven't even gone for any merchantmen, so they don't even have that much selling power to rush. I told you this guy's kind of bad. Yeah, he's definitely not the best player of all time. Am I good against this?
Not even close. Best mortar micro around. They're dead AI. They tower boost. Okay. It was an accident going for the 230 mortar at the start. Wanna cook, but it's not terrible when you're against people going boat, anyways. GG easy. Easy GG. No, Homeland, Homeland defense doesn't pierce buff Spike Storms. Spike Storm can't receive pierce buffs. So, in my recent video, I was thinking that the Biker Bones would pierce buff them, but that doesn't work either. So, I was wrong. By the way, guys, if you're not already in my Discord server, exclamation point Discord in the chat, and um, you can join my Discord server. It's pretty fun in there. We have a good time. Jake, 6542. And we still do not get... Koru, how nice. Yeah, it is, Kevin. And it's 25% damage buff to um to Perma Spike. Perma Spike gets buffed as well. Since when is Jake6542 just someone who goes whatever the meta strategy is on every map? Or what people think is the meta strategy? So I used to be a Bolt Alchemist player. Bolt Alchemist is really good on this map anyways, so I don't, I don't know what got into him. I'm not exactly sure, Smiley, how it works. I was kind of just going with what people are saying. The sun god fights on the side with the best artillery. What's up? Have you tried to turning it off and on again? We don't know if I remember going meta, unheard of. True. I don't think Explosion has only 25% buff, it's only initial supermines, gotcha. Bikes do a huge ton of damage, yeah. <laughs> I'm not reading another copy pasta, dude. I spent enough time reading that first one. Ryan, if you had to destroy a diamond, which tower would you use and which upgrade? Destroy a diamond? Which tower and upgrade would I use to destroy it? Hmm. Super mines would probably go crazy, right? A huge explosion? Or would you need something like precise, like a ray of doom to just melt through it? Oh no, there's a two upgrades that come to mind. 
Yeah, they use Churchill ability. I don't think... I don't like this idea of using Churchill ability here. I would have just upgraded the submarine more, because now... I can balloon boost black balloons, and this is a little bit of a problem from them for them without Churchill ability available. Yeah, they have to they have to tower boost this and go for another sub. So they're down a tower boost now. Oh, do I not get do I not get my um? I don't get my merchantman here. The round got anti stalled somehow. Pretty sure. We'll get round seven merchant. They use Churchill ability again. It's fine. Dude. So we got a boost out of them, which is always nice. Smart targeting. L Tanner. L Tanner indeed. Honestly, cinemas at least church ability. It's good. Them tower boost. I'll take it. So they're down two tower boosts now. Does that not defend? Oh, that does defend, I mean. Okay. Wait, no, it doesn't. They use Churchill ability. They bought up a ballistic. Okay, that works. We're pretty old here. We're good. Bombs and farm usable on this map with Churchill. It is. That's like the that's like the meta strategy on this map. I definitely should have sent an actual rush instead of sending ceramics like that. But ceramics were not very good, but we still got a ballistic out of them at the end of the day. So I guess it's not terrible. But yeah, I could have sent better rushes probably. We have bombs and farms. What most people think is the meta on this map. Oh, it's Trojan. I shouldn't have even gotten Alk buff against this, to be honest. The spike factory was soloed easily because there's no ceramics to come out. The Alk buff was totally unnecessary there. That's fine, though. Are they dead? No, they're good. Nicely done. Oh, they're not dead. They're not good. <laughs> oh, 
Bomb sub farm was recently nerfed. They nerfed the pierce of the cluster. Then see that leak? It's desync. Sometimes opponents leak and you don't see it. And sometimes you see leaks and they don't leak. It happens both ways. Bro, can we... Oh my gosh, bro. Do we go Takai's farm on this map? That's what he said. I have to go Takai's farm on this map. With Oban. What is this, dude? Kevin, bro, what are you making me do? There's literally no way you win this. There isn't. There's no way I can win, I'm pretty sure. I've got no clue how to win with this on this map, but... Kevin said if I get core or ports, I have to go this load up, load out. So... I think we're donating ELO to Dragon Star this game. Blade start? Yeah. Where'd I put the camera? Right there? And to him right. I have to remove this obstacle was the problem. What if I... Hmm. I think I've just got to do it like this. I've got some space to equal to be able to afford defense in time. 500 remove the obstacle is so awful. Why go open with a slowdown? This was the request. This is a requested strategy. I didn't have choice in it. But open's honestly not a bad hero pick for the loadout. All things considered. Uh, I'm still gonna leak a million lives here. We're alive, though. One more equal boost to get my blade up. The embrittlement doesn't even do anything on this map's the problem, and the embrittlement is my camo, or my decamo. I need it. But on this map, it's like not gonna hit anything. So I don't... I don't know how I'm gonna play it. Not against Jericho, luckily. Jericho wouldn't honestly cause... Well, I mean, the steals would be annoying, but Jericho's camos wouldn't be that, that bad, because I have open brambles deal with them. Does this reach? I think this bramble reaches here. I'm pretty sure it does. I'm gonna rely on it. Yep, it does reach. Look at that. Perfect. Open bramble OP. Uh, I need a boost, don't I? Oh, Oban, stop missing, stop missing! Uh, I don't like boost. I shouldn't. I should have just boosted without building up defense. 
I thought we'd be able to afford defense in time to defend without boost, but... We're fine. Yeah, that's, that's extremely expensive is the problem, Daryl. But even Embrit on the water is not going to hit the whole thing. The Embrit's range isn't that big, so Embrit on the water wouldn't really do anything. It's better just to put it on the land. Okay, they're going ace back, so they're not even they're not going a great loadout. So I mean that's one thing we got going for us. Am I dead? Dude. I need this to be able to. Let's go! Come on! Yes, sir! Best strategy of all time. Newport's meta. Newport's meta, ladies and gentlemen. Sands of Time. I'm gonna go Oban. We'll go some Druid sub farm here. No, the the thing is, the if you have an embrittlement and an Arctic Wind. It defends stuff pretty well, but the problem is um, your early game's pretty awful. Building that up is expensive, and you have to remove a crate for it. So there's so many hoops and stuff you have to jump through to get to the embrittlement and the arctic wind. Like, I had zero boosts when I built it up. Okay, they're going boomerang. It's probably boomer mortar farm. It's probably boomer mortar farm here. I might open up. So we just want to take this lead if it is boomer mortar farm because we have a much better leaking. I became a boomer mortar NG player. What? I thought that was a bozo strategy with Mir. The heck? What got to you, bro? Worms. What map are you going at now? Koru? Yeah, it's pretty good in Koru. Boom Mortar Farm, Boom Mortar Energy. Definitely horror meta. Target. Oh no. Okay, don't chase. We're good, Druid. Wait, I didn't get my farm down. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. Keep going strong, probably. I don't want my Druid chasing here. Leak. My music teacher once called me a bozo. Your music teacher called you a bozo once? 
Sounds like she was correct. Oh, they're not even Golden Boom Mortar Farm. They're sending me uh, Eco Balloons. I'm literally a couple doors off. They're not even sending me White Slow, so I'm chilling. Super Farm Village Adora. Kevin, do you just want me to lose at this point? Like, first you tell me to go tack farm ice oban on ports. And now you want me to go super farm village with Adora. Is she now, Shovey Cow? Is she learning the ways? A donation is a donation. It is a donation, indeed. I do have to respect the donation, but... Kevin's trying to throw my elo. Super farm village Adora. Bro thinks, bro thinks we're in a Boltrix Bonanza video right now. This is whole masters, dude. Oh, they do a farm. Okay. So it's Boom and Mortar Farm for sure. You think NG Ace Pack would be good on Dino? NG Ace Pack. It could work on Dino for sure. I wouldn't say it's a bad loadout, but definitely there's definitely better options. But I could see NG Ace Pack working on Dino. You probably wouldn't want to run Jericho with it though. If you ran Jericho with it, I think you'd be too weak for round 11, round 13. Because you don't have farm money. You probably want to run, like, Gwendolyn or, I don't know, something to help you defend. I guess Ben could maybe work. You gonna rush me? I'm literally a couple doors off. I honestly didn't even need my reactor against that. That was a tiny rush. Um, Is that a super I expected it to be a bigger rush, but yeah. Super Farm Village Adora. Super Farm Village Adora. Okay, well they boost against Rainbow Eco, so I can probably force more Glaives here with Ceramics. Oh, they just bought it anyways. Alright, they're good. We'll get around um, 14 bank would be the plan. I should probably be unsubmerging this as well to stole rounds. Uh, we'll, we'll keep it submerged at the start of rounds, at least. So we can keep some brambles up. Is he gonna rush me? Yep. We'll boost this. And that regrow farmed, actually. I needed a boost immediately. Oh well. Let's talk payment. I needed to immediately boost against it. I thought we could just wait a little bit before he boosted, but the regrow farm was crazy. We gotta get a long map here for this Adora Super Monkey thing. There we go. I'll take it. I'll take it. Did you have air burst on reactor? I did. Karma. No ballistics. You don't need a ballistic. I if I boosted earlier, I would have been fine. You don't need a ballistic against it if you're boosting. All right, here we go. 
Ryan, I good? You're good, bro. Yo, GG shaft. Gwendolyn is enemy girl hero. True. The sun god is with me. Problem is I can I can't stay leakless with the slowed up too early game. I'll leak for sure. Pretty sure. Maybe if I send like zero balloons. Let me see. Six fifty plus two fifty. That's not gonna. Is that does that add up to eighteen hundred? I can send a little bit. I can send that much. And that won't delay my super monkey. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna leak though. I'll definitely leak. Oh well. Farm defends round one, true. A door start? A door start's not going to be leakless. That do it doesn't even get close to defending reds. I honestly might die with an Adora start because it doesn't do very good against reds. And then I just delay me getting my super monkey, which does defend. What is bro cooking? I'm in the I'm in the kitchen, bro. I'm in the kitchen. Trust. All right, they got their air burst up. Nicely done. Yeah, Kevin. What's the reward if I win with this loadout somehow? Somehow, some way. Do I get any reward? Do I get a thumbs up? But this defends round six. This will defend until yellow balloons, grouped yellows. If they send me grouped yellows, then I'll be screwed. I'll need more defense. $50? Okay. $50. If I win. That's crazy, dude. $50 is a big donation. That's on the line. I gotta make sure I focus up here. Get second submarine down. Against yellows, do I just go for super range? Probably, right? We'll just pre buy it because they're definitely going to send me yellows. This still, I think, it's overrun, but it will get overrun very slowly. This door ability. Actually, it might not get overrun. When the Super Monkey's maximizing its pierce, it's doing decent. Alright. Wait, how do I defend leads? How do I do? Oh wait, no. Adora has lead popping, right? Adora pops leads, right? Yeah, we're going we're good against camel leads then, because I can get a camel village with it. If Adora doesn't have lead popping, then I'm screwed against leads. But I think I'm fine. Only with ability. No, only with ability does Adora hit camo. But I, I can get a camel village, which is the plan. Alright. Nice try, buddy. Nice try, pal. You're gonna have to try harder than that to get through the big Mahalik. Bye. 
Nice cocktail spot. Is he dead? I didn't want to win like that, I'll be honest. I didn't want to win like that. I might I'll go the strategy again for you guys. That that was not a very exciting game, but we still won. <sighs> Most intelligence Gwen player, yeah. Definitely go again. I'll go again. The opponent's cocktail was just targeted on the purple balloons. It did nothing. And I don't think they cross path their reactor either. I think their cro reactor was uncross pathed. So the reactor was not doing much either. Oh, and we got Smiley the Foot. Why well, don't want to go this strategy against Smiley the Foot? This guy knows what he's actually doing. I'll just lose. I'm not going to go it, especially not on Garden. I'm not going to go it. We'll go this. Dart Sniper Ninja. And ready. I've made a lot of special modifications myself. Here you go, Oldo. That was underwhelming. Kevin with a $50 donation still. Oh my gosh, Kevin. Thank you so much for the donation. Wow. I'll, I'll go the strategy again for you. I'm going to try another one for you, um, especially because you did that donation, but I'll go it again. And I'll, I'll try to take it a little bit later, hopefully. Hopefully my opponent doesn't die against a round 11 rush, but thank you. I appreciate that a lot. W's in the chat from my boy Kevin. Kevin's been going crazy with the donations recently. Thank you so much, bro. Good googly moogly. Kevin is a man of his words. He is indeed. Ryan, didn't you name a tower Cavan? Uh, I'm not sure if I have before. I could name a tower Cavan if he wants me to. I don't know if I don't know if there's a current tower named named Cavan. Okay, they're definitely going boat elk spike factory. By the way, my opponent. Yes, it's rain hard. So it's boat elk spike factory versus dart sniper ninja. Is that a super chat I smell? Thank you. Here you go. I'll take ninja. Okay. Underwhelming. I'll name Ninja Cabin. We're gonna have an insane eco here. These rounds are gonna get sold so much because the AI balloons have to travel like the map length, lots of the map length before they get popped. So our eco this game, guys, is gonna be really high. But my opponent's eco is gonna be high as well. So I mean, obviously that's part of it. Puts on last. We're good. Let's actually put my farmer and my balloon bot in the secretive spots, ladies and gentlemen. Secretive farmer and balloon bot spot. Look at this. Look at this. You can place it over here. One right there, and then we put the balloon bot with it. W. W spots. They got their can ship up. They'll probably get a round six merchant man, my guess is. That's my guess. We'll get that round six merchant. That the secret spots were out of the bundle, yeah. Kevin can also use the secret spots for his fifty dollars. That's included. You have you have property rights on these the balloon bottom farmer spots. They got their merchant up. Excellent. We'll send them yellow balloons till the end of time now. Just hold it down, ladies and gentlemen. 
They're sending me those too. Are we not allowed to otherwise? No, these are um, these are private property. The farmer and bluebutt spots. Yeah, they went for a long life spikes on their side. Fair enough. My eco is pretty good here. Say. All things considered. A thousand fifty eco on round nine is a pretty good pace here. Just a little bit of eco, just a little bit, just a wee bit. I said from the start that I was gonna get a ton of eco, because the rounds got max stalled. Pretty much. Well not exactly max stalled, but stalled an insane amount. Now one downside is they're going to make money off my eco, because obviously they have forever to gold and all that jazz. Thirteen hundred eco in round twelve. How much does this cost? I don't want to get this up. Supply drop. Alright, we're good. Got the supply drop up. They're still not rushing me, so I mean... Round 15 supply drops crazy. Yeah, it is pretty crazy. It is indeed. I feel like I'll have more money than them this game. We definitely have a much higher eco than them. Obviously, they have rubber to gold and boat farms, but we have sniper farms, which aren't bad either. So. I feel like, yeah, we'll definitely have more money. Get elite sniper round 17. Nah, I'm gonna get another, we'll get another normal supply crate, and then, um, the next time the supply crate comes around, we'll get the lead sniper. That's the plan. I did not need to boost that, to be honest. That was a bad boost moment. I should defend though. Yeah, we defend. 4k. Yeah. Isn't 50 but gotta support Gold Halic for the great content? Yo, Gohar, thank you so much for the donation, bro. Appreciate that a ton. Thank you. Thank you, bro. Really appreciate that. All right, we'll start mixing some zebra blue Nico now. Definitely didn't defend the rushes the best, to be honest, but we defended them at the end of the day. Actually, zebra blue Nico might not be the smartest decision against double owl, but we're still we're still sending it. Force tower boost on their end.
Yeah, we're good. Start sniper farming. A super I just don't want to use my last Thank boost. I want to save my last boost for late game. Thank you again for the donation, though. I really appreciate it, bro. Also, I didn't know, don't know how to become a paid, paid member or channel sub. Exclamation point member in the chat. Should kind of help you out. Uh, what do I even do against this? Sticky bomb, maybe? I don't exactly know the way you're supposed to defend the BFB with this loadout. This probably works. That's a, I'm spending a lot to defend it though with a sticky bomb. There might be cheaper alternatives. But they're sending me a ZMG for sure here. Is it fortified or is it no? It's fortified, okay. Wait, I just used Churchill build against nothing. Nice job, Ryan. You're so smart. Definitely a little bit of an over defend, but I didn't boost, which is all that matters. Not boosting was the most important part there. Yo, Gohar, thank you so much for joining the Mahalik squad, bro. Enjoy the W's in the chat for Gohar. Thank you so much, dude. I really appreciate it. I shouldn't be ecoing at the moment. Go for a couple more sniper farms. I'm gonna do I have nine. There's ten. They're gonna get their super mines pretty soon. We're just gonna get a full plasma monkey fan club up. They boost their super mines, that's fine. That's a full PMFC. We're gonna cross path all these. Target about half of them on strong. All 
All right. We're going to get a sticky bomb right here. Actually go for two stickies. Uh, not two stickies, just one sticky is fine. Triple Moab. This will be a Grandmaster Ninja up here. Strong. This will be a Crossbow Master down here. Grandmaster Ninja. Did a couple salvos up. Crosspath through supply drops with attacking speed? No, it's not. I don't want to crosspath them. These aren't for damage at all. They do basically no damage. They're just for money. Okay, we'll start sending them. How do I become a member? I know I'm subscribed. Exclamation point member in the chat. There's a... The membership's paid, by the way, but... There, there, it should redirect you to the membership page. The link. They have no super mine pile left now, so I can just send ZOMGs to probably kill them. Their super mine pile is gone from the BADs I sent. So, yeah, they're gonna be dead. Where's Dart? Okay, we almost died actually, but we're good. I didn't sell my elite sniper. I should have. But we won. GG's. Close one. Almost choked against the DT counter. Why didn't you Super Monkey Fan Club? I didn't have money for a Super Monkey Fan Club. I would have had to sell my uh, my Super Monkey Fan Club doesn't have camo touch anyways. The Master Bomber is enough. I just saboed late. Didn't have good ceramic cleanup. I didn't have any uh, snipers on the map, Cal. I sold all my snipers for defense to rush them and stuff. The elite sniper was pretty much useless at that point. Oh my gosh. Um, I guess we can try it again on this map. The sun god is with me. I thought the cripple was still on screen. No, I sold the cripple. I sold the cripple when I was, um, and I was sending them a million uh, ZMGs at the end. Did it work decently here? No. I don't know about the placements. I feel like Super Monkey won't, won't defend that well on this map. It, I feel like it's going to get blocked by obstacles, but who knows? We'll see. I feel like it's going to get blocked hard by obstacles. This person's definitely going Bomb Mortar Heli as well, which is... Gonna be kind of annoying to play against. Got our super monkey down. 
think this is the good place. I think this is a decent placement for it. It's a decent spot. A decent spot for it. Uh, door will go... There's a door, like, right here. I think. Yeah, Bulltrix and I just play, make different content, bro. Still got tons of respect for him. For the man. How's Bulltrix rude, bro? Is it possible to blood sacrifice a farm to make it make more money? No, that doesn't it doesn't work like that. It doesn't work on farms. People have tried that. It'd be cool if it did. Oh, they have farm actually. They have farm. I thought they had bomb mortar heli. That's balloon boost. This should force tower boost or uh, heavy bombs, and they end up tower boosting. Okay. Oh, Ladies and gentlemen, we are a super monkey player out farming a bomb player. Everybody take screenshots right now. This is the only time you'll see it. We have an out farm. We have an. We had an out farm on a bomb player with super monkey. Take your screenshots, make them last. No, I got the screenshot late. <laughs> I feel like def defending round 13 is gonna be unbelievably difficult with my loadout is the problem here. Like round 11, round 13, I don't know how I'm gonna do it on this map too. We were on star last time, which is definitely an easier map for it. Also, my super monkey's chasing now, which is a little bit of a problem. I don't know how this came about. I think I'm gonna get super range on this, and then hopefully stop it from chasing. Okay, we're good. It stopped chasing now. They're doing that. We're fine. <laughs> All right, is he going to rush me? Do I need a boost? No boost, no boost, no boost. Let's go! I'm cooking. I'm cooking, chat. Wow, well, super OP. Super is OP. Ryan's a master chef right now. No, lead balloons are my weakness, bro. Boost. No, that kills me, that kills me. Oh, I thought boost would defend. I boosted a little bit late there, I'm pretty sure. Dang it. If I boosted right away, I think I defend that with my defense. I needed a boost initial right away there. I needed a boost right away. And then against a rerush, I'd go for a, um, against a rerush, I'd go for a Robo Monkey. It's gonna be the plan.
Okay, we'll try it one more time. One more time. I don't really care about score. No, I don't think I would have died if I boosted right away. I boosted after the balloons got on the button path a little bit. I definitely waited too long. The sun god is with me. Let's do this. <clears throat> Okay. Throw and tack here. Fair enough. I think 256 eco is the correct amount. Yeah, 256 eco is the correct amount here. And Super Monkey is going to be placed like right here. We're going to place it right here. Uh, We're not going to die, right? We're good. Not even close. Oh, this guy's playing anti-stall with tack, bro. What? This guy's just gonna anti-stall the rounds and try to kill me around 13 as well, probably. What's gonna happen? They're going anti-stall with tack. That's gonna be hard to w win against. Move my camera down there. I waited it unconscious. Really got their farm down. I await the transformation to bit of warfare. The thing about the slow is the defense is pretty expensive initially, because you need all of this on like round three, but all right, then. then you don't really need to buy more defense for a bit. <laughs> this should defend white balloons. Unless the super monkey misses every shot. Which honestly could happen. Increased production. Alright, everything's going good. Why does my Wi-Fi die at around 13 stars when I send constant group balloons? I'm so mad. That is annoying. I'm sorry about that, Nick. Have a good stream, Ryan. Yo, see you, Daryl. Thanks for stopping by. That's not exactly it, Cody. I haven't blocked you from the chat. It's more so I just... If you continue to just be rude about everyone and talk bad about everyone, then I might block you, but there's tons of people in the chat that I disagree with that aren't blocked. But I have to keep positive chat environments in my stream. But you aren't blocked currently, so don't give me a reason to. Go for one more farm. It's tax sub farm from them. Yeah, they don't have any late game with their loadout, so I don't really. Hmm. They don't have a late game, so I just need to survive first like 25 rounds, and then we'll be good. It's gonna be zebras. Go for extra range. How's this doing? Go for one more farm upgrade. Let's go for epic range. Okay, that defends pretty well. Is it worth freezing farms then round 11 selling for MIB? Thousand super monkey with epic range? Nah, MIB wouldn't be the move. I'm gonna go for a robo monkey. MIB is way too expensive. Robo Monkey is what I'll do against big rushes. Feel the light. 
They send me a big rush. Suck and super monkey, boost and door ability. That's the plan. I might honestly just pre-place the second super monkey. That's a small rush. I think I just defend this without boost. Yeah, that rush was tiny. Small rush we defend without boost. Boost this. We're good. We're good, we're good. The cells for 2,660. Where is it? Where is it, bro? You re rushing me? Or no? No rush? I've got my boost back now, so I might as well farm. Oh, there's a rush. Boost this. Grow blocker village at the top to stop the regrow farm. You like that tech? I might have gotten regrow farmed on if I didn't go for this. Okay, opponent's still not allowing me. I'm gonna farm on. I'm gonna get 1k eco. Uh, let's go 1.25k. Like 1.25. 8500 for Robo. Uh, 1300 eco. I changed my mind again. There we go. My farm's eco is not honestly terrible. I've got four marketplaces up. Ryan, could you do challenges soon aside from sweat series? I don't know. I've never really been a huge fan of challenge type videos like Boltrix does. It's not really what my content's necessarily based around. I kind of just like doing new strategies, showcasing balance changes and sweating. I mean, sometimes I do a challenge every now and then, but it's not really my brand. Is he rushing me? Yep. All right, bro does not know about the sun avatar. And then if he sends purples, I just get up the little monkey toge bureau. Yep, there's purples. Also sacrifice the super monkey here. They le level this up. And then we can use bowl of light here. Let's also get a jungle drums on this. Dude, sun avatar is insane. Dude, why is sun avatar so strong? It just like soloed that entire rush. Without a boost. Why all out when Tech Terror exists? I don't even need Tech Terror. Sun Avatar solos. Tech Terror is not needed. Sun Avatar literally just solos it. Wait, maybe not. No! <laughs> not even close, 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 not even close. I'm not Tech Terroring, I don't care. I'm not tech tearing. I'm not tech tearing. I'm gonna do everything in my power not to tech tear. Just to sh show you guys. I don't need it. Sacrifice it. Alright, we're good. We're good. If you threw. I've, have I ever thrown a game before? Have I ever thrown a game before, guys? Come on. 
You know me. I don't throw matches. Chat. All right. Okay, we are going to raid someone now. Give me one second, chat. Yes, you have? What do you mean I have? I have never raided. I have never thrown a match before. Like, what? If you have seen me throwing a match, guys, you're lying. That's just never happened. Okay, let me, um, one second, guys. Everybody like the stream, by the way. Like the stream. Right now, hit the like button with your forehead. Boomer on Glade? Nah. Nah, that wasn't, bro. What are you talking about? That's not true. It's not true. Okay, we, there's someone streaming Blue and Sea Battles 2, and they said their name, they said better than Ryan Mahalik, which just isn't true. So, we're gonna raid them, and it's like, look at this gameplay. What is this? They have, they probably just started, but we're going to raid them. So everybody head over to the stream. Um, it's a W stream though. And, um, yeah, teach them how to play balloon sea battles too. Thank you everyone for um, stopping by. Everybody go to their stream and say Ryan Mahalik raid. Peace out guys. Thank you all for tuning in. Have a good one.